Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm here with my lovely wife, Laura. Who's very excited. And I'm, I'm pretty excited too, because we have Shopkins Season 6. <gasps> Woo! Season 6! Chef Club Season, which apparently, and I don't really know what this means, is a limited season. So, yeah. so hmm. um, <laughs> I was walking our son today just in case you're walking our son well walking <laughs> he was out and about with our son not yes. walking him <laughs> no um and i went to kmart and they were literally just putting these out the shelves like today yes so we are in australia um for anyone who hasn't sort of watched our videos and didn't know that so i have no idea about other countries um i haven't really seen a lot that are out in mm -hmm. america as far as i know but and, i'm we're not from there i so. think most of the people on youtube were sent to them directly from moose so yeah very so exciting. yeah we think these are pretty brand new <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to quickly show you just each sort of package we've got and then we're going to cut to um, open them all up yeah we'll cut to them <laughs> so we've got a nice closer sort of view yeah. of them so, so first we have the five packs and their recipe books this time as the sort of hidden instead capsule instead of like basket sort of yes. um or bag sort of ones so we've got two five packs and then we have the 12 pack so as you can see you've got two so there's at least three different color recipe books yeah so what blue what pink and green yes and then we have a couple of kind of the play sets that have exclusive shopkins that are only in the play set so we have the jumpin juicer which obviously comes with all the exclusive shopkins as well as the and we juicer have parts. the hot waffle collection which comes with the wicked waffle maker and i think there was a couple more but i couldn't find any more this was all our store basically had. Yeah, so, so we couldn't find any two packs. This is all they had. So, so far. So but far. we will definitely be keeping our eyes open for those. All right. So um, what we're going to do is we're just going to cut to sort of a nice we'll angle. open something. Yeah. Zoom in a bit. Yes. And we'll be back. Sounds good. All right. So we've just reorganized our little filming area and we've uh, partially opened up one of the five packs. That's where we're going to start. So let's see if we can get the... We'll have a quick look back. Um, so for this season, um, the limited editions are glitter q tensils. <laughs> I think that's pretty cool. Um, ultra rares are the dazzling dishes, and this is sort of some of the ones you can get. So the concept um, is a bit different for season yes. six. They're ingredients that you collect, and then and it makes whatever it is. It makes like the ultra rare recipe kind of one. And the other unique thing is you can have the same shotgun in different recipes. Yeah. Like they're, they're called base ingredients. Yeah. Like they're flour like, and sugar and yeah, all that. Yeah, butter and all that kind yeah. of thing. Um, and then where was it? Where did I see uh, something? No, it must have been on the 12-pack. Um, the special editions. Um, yes. Were... Colour changes. Colour changes. Thank yeah. you. I couldn't remember. Um, and also, this time around, there is an app. Um, so you can scan the Shopkins that you get, like your ingredients, and sort of bring your dishes to life. Sort of makes so, them free, like... Um, what well, we, we think. We think. We're so, taking a guess at that. Yeah. Or maybe it'll come up with like a, an actual recipe that you can make in real life or something. I don't know. I think you should stop talking and do some more opening because I'm excited. Me too. So, let's get this out. We can take that part. Alright, do you want to start taking those out of the tray? And yes. then let's take a look at the checklist <clears throat> for season six. Now, I, I didn't think these were coming out till December 2016. Yeah. And so earlier was, it was October sometime we saw. So. Yeah, really exciting. Um, okay, so obviously same um, sort of rarities as before. And those are the different finishes that we just talked about. Ah, so staple ingredients, not basics or whatever you called them. I wasn't sure. So the shop can speak in more than one recipe. So we have, for the breakfast category, we have scrambled eggs and all the things that go into that. Um, and obviously then, when you get to the end of the recipe, that's when you start getting the rare, ultra rare and special edition ones. Strawberry pancakes. Make a banana smoothie. Waffles and raspberries. Lemon and honey tea. A sausage egg muffin. That would be nice right now. Mm. Then we move to the bakery category. We have cupcake princess. We have cookies. We have carrot cake. Apple pie. I see flu flour or whatever flour. that is in quite a few of them. Family food, we have spaghetti bolognese, veggie pizza, honey soy noodles, mm. fried rice. Making sure you sweet eat after this. Yeah, I'm hungry now. <laughs> this sweets category, we have banana split, chocolate sundae, honeycomb ice cream mm, cake. That yes, sounds please. nice, yeah. Ice cream sandwich. And then, as we mentioned, the limited editions are the utensils, so we'll probably never ever see one of those. <laughs> and um, the recipe cards. And which... collect, tick, and store 18 recipe cards, plus obviously the app 
information down the bottom. Now there is one major thing different with the uh, thing. So what I'll do is I'll show them in you. Book them up. Yep. <laughs> but there's a little um, QR code on the back which you can scan to bring them to life. For the app. Yep. So, so who do we have? It looks like. Uh, it looks like a tomato. No, mango. Mango? A mango? Really? I don't know. Um, I'll try and find them as quick as I can, but obviously um, previous seasons of the checklist, you know, has been like all fruit category, so you know that if it's fruit, it's in there, but not the case for this one, and I'm having it's uh, Roma, Roma tomato. So I was right. So that will go into the spaghetti bolognese. Now, and these are common. We have... Come on, let's focus. That looks like a bowl of something. <laughs> Delicious chocolate. Chocolate chips for the chocolate sundae and is also a common um they also have marked whether they're staple ingredients and that's a staple ingredient so and, and but the tomato isn't hmm, this <clears> one <throat> says parsley on the front i'm not sure if the camera can pick it up but... okay what would we have parsley in I'm trying to look at like thing some of the recipes that you might it looks parsley like in. bridey basil no it's, well, it's not that one i don't know it's just parsley it could be basil no, poly parsley for the scrambled eggs. And, and that's have, rare. Oh, beautiful. And we have, it looks like a hot chocolate. Very tasty looking one too. Hot chocolate. Hmm. Um, this is going to take a while, I think. This this checklist, um, obviously, is really cool for the idea of the recipes, but a bit hard to actually locate them in. Well, how about uh, you open your mystery one, and I'll still try and find so, that there cup we go. one. Shopkins Chef Club recipes. Ah, Choc E Tubs. So it's actually chocolate ice cream, oh. that one, um, which is for the chocolate sundae. Right, so first of all, we have we Winona waffles. Cool. So that's a little recipe card. How cute. And you've got, sorry, he's trying to hold it up. So there's like a mini checklist for each recipe. I like that. So, what a nifty little idea. So here's our blind. Oh, come back with the recipe book. Did you oh. take a look at that? Yes, I did. That's so cute. Good. I did. Good. I wasn't paying attention, clearly. <laughs> They're in blind bags. And who do we have? Ooh, looks that like... one looks like um, the, the egg muffin that I mentioned. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, sausage egg muffin, was that what it was? Yeah. So Barbie breakfast muffin. And that's an ultra rare. It is. Well, that's really cool. Beautiful. What would you like to open up next? How lucky is that? Um, how about we go one of the play sets at the back? All so right, we'll, we'll just get that open. Yeah. So we're back. Now, this is excellent because a lot of the old play sets don't actually come with this, the early no, ones. No, we should mention we opened the waffle play yes, set. the hot waffle. And they actually come with an individual checklist with each one inside. Yes, because these are obviously exclusive to the waffle pack, so they're not going to be on the regular checklist. And previously you kind of had to look on the back of the pack or online. Hey, Juicy Smoothie. Maybe we do have both of the play sets because all I can see is Juicy Smoothie and the hot waffle. Oh, well, so, that's kind of cool. Uh, so let's have a look at just some of the pieces first. So the we have waffle. the little waffle maker, and it's actually got like the little lines like a waffle maker would have inside, which is quite nice and opens and closes. And then this is a little stand it comes on. This is just a bit of cardboard, so you could leave that in there if you wanted you want a nice to look decoration. Nice. Yep. So pop that over the back. Then you have a plate to serve your waffle, which is just like plastic yeah. plate, not um, rubbery like the Shopkins, and a mixing jug for your batter. If, if these don't look too amazing, I look a bit sort of small, um, this was only $2 more than like a 12 pack, and you get... Eight Yeah, Shopkins. so it's not, not too much of a difference in price. So, you've got our checklist. Who are these exclusive Shopkins? That would be Webster Waffle. Webster Waffle. Who is delicious. Well, I'm sure he is. We also have another waffle. That's Winston Waffle, who is okay. also delicious. Delicious. Is that yeah. what it says on there? No, that's the rarity. <laughs> you just say, is that the rarity is delicious? <laughs> no, they're, they're, they're all, there's no rarity. They're just a, yeah. That's Rosa Raspberry. Rosa Raspberry. She reminds me of the other raspberry. Mm. Um, Shopkins definitely looks very similar. Scooper. Scooper. So you got some ice cream for your waffle. Mm. That handle I don't think would hold up very well with that much ice cream That's on there. That's a lot there. of ice cream. This is Charlie Chalk Block. I like that one. Yeah. He looks like he's kind of melting at the bottom, like on his sides he too. He looks like a, a brown gumby. <laughs> yeah, kind of. <laughs> These look like strawberries. Uh, straw besties. <laughs> okay. okay. Okay, good one there. I see what you did. Oh, this one I'm guessing is some sort of syrup. Sadie syrup. And obviously the QR code on the back. And it's probably my favourite one coming up. 
Your favourite one, is it? Bowl o bananas. <laughs> Bowl o bananas. <laughs> they do look like little slices of banana, actually. Yeah, I think the camera's picked that up all right. Hmm. Well, that's a really, really cute little play set. And I don't remember the last Hang time on. I had a waffle. Now I really want a waffle. We need to put the bananas in the waffle set. There we go. You're cooking the bananas in the waffle yeah. maker? Waffle bananas. Mm. Banana right. waffles. What, do you want to open a 12-pack next? I think we should do a 12-pack. All right, we'll be right back. All right, we've opened up our 12-pack, so let's have a look at the ones on the front cover first. The front that cover. That looks like a tea bag. <laughs> it does. So that it's would be, I think there was tea on the front. Herb L tea bag. Herb L tea bag. Okay. Who is a common? Then we have this one, which looks like, I don't know, it's creamy. Ice cream yeah. or something. Uh, Very pink on the top. Well, it's not going to be in scrambled eggs, I doubt. <laughs> I would certainly uh, hope you're not putting something pink and creamy in scrambled eggs. You're having trouble there. How about I look at the next one while you... That one looks you... like um, Frida Frosting. Okay. Who sh pot is... No. Yeah. Show on the camera. Hang on. Hang on. So she's a color changer, I think. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, well, we're in a 12 pack. They're yeah. the special edition. So yeah. we could have a color changer. Yeah. We'll have to check that out. We will have to check that out. Right, okay. No wonder there was confusion over there from Nathan. Confusion and delay. You can tell we're watching too many tank engines. Yeah. Uh, and then we've got a mushroom there, a pink that sort would of be top mushroom. mushroom. It's nice and easy. This is one of my favourites that I've seen so far. Buncho bananas. Buncho bananas. That is so bananas. cute. I love to. I don't know how well the camera's showing it, but it kind of goes from a yellow up into a green tinge at the top too, which is really, really nice. Bunch of bananas is common, by the way. Okay. As was button mushroom. Fair enough. And then we have some strawberries here in a little tub. That's uh, it's not raspberry. It's strawberry top. Here's a common. Okay. We have our first double already, which Another is Roma rose. tomato. Yes. I remember. <laughs> it's going to call it Rosa Tomato. <laughs> no. Now, this one's just like a round yellow. Uh, Is it like a wheel of cheese, maybe? or? I'm not sure. Let me take a look. I've at... seen the butter one, because the butter one, they think, is on the front of one of our other like packs that we have to open. So that one's not butter, but... Uh, sorry. I've stumped Nathan on that one. It almost looks like um, Madeline Muffin. That can't be a muffin. Oh, sort of. But I don't I, I don't see any like really light ones. Like hmm. they must have cooked with brown, so I'll keep looking for that. Alright, so that's possibly the muffin that goes to make our hmm. um, egg muffin one which I forgot the name of. It looks like cheese. Ooh, I don't know. That could be like noodles or something or pasta of some sort. This is tricky. It could be like spaghetti. There was a spaghetti bolognese recipe. It's not Nina Noodles, maybe. Do you yeah. need some help? Should I be getting out the checklist yeah. and having a look at the checklist for this one as well? My uh, I think it's, it's Bella Mozzarella. Bella Mozzarella. Okay, so you found it. And that's green, so that would be rare. Oh, beautiful. All right. Then we have this one, which looks like, I don't know, ice cream, I would guess. Yes. Probably up the top there. V Nilla Tubs. Okay, that makes sense. And another double, which was the uh, chocolate Choc chips. Yes. So we'll put him up there with his counterpart. Now, we have our two mystery ones. So one of them is in a blue recipe book. They're quite hard to open, by the way. Are they? Yes. Oh, they are really tricky. All right, our little checklist book is for Natalie Noodles and has her ingredients inside. What do we have? Something big and chunky in this one. Big and chunky. Big and chunky, yep. Ooh. Oh, that looks pretty cool. What is that? Well, that looks like one of the um, end results of the recipe. Yes, it does. It's a bit, it's almost like it's metallic. Stax cookie. Stax cookie. Oh, it's all tied up too. Oh, that's mm -hmm. so cute. So I'll put him there with our, our muffin because they're both like end muffin. recipes. Muffin. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, now we got twirly spaghetti little recipe card. There we go. It really is nice. Like they, some of the other sets were hard to find, especially play sets and things. So it's good that they've given you a couple of options to track your collection. Yeah, nice way to do it. And our last one is icing sugar. It actually says icing sugar, although I don't know the camera's picking that up. Uh, can you show me the front? Hmm. Having trouble with that one, are you? 
Well, it's not going to be under scrambled eggs. Uh, no, I would not put uh, icing sugar in my scrambled eggs. What would we put icing sugar in that's on the checklist? Mm, these are really tricky to find. Don't know. I thought that one would stand out. There's a caster sugar one there, but cane sugar. Aha, here in the carrot cake. It is iris icing sugar. These are rare. These are rare. There you go. Okay. She was tricky to locate. Now, what do you want to do? A play set? How about we do the other play set, the jumpin' juicer. Let's open it up. Alright, so we have the juicy smoothie collection. Yes. I had to double check what that was. <laughs> Let's have a look so what you get. It comes with like the juicer, which you can open up, and there's a little thing here which actually spins. So oh, you that's can cool. put, say, hey, something. Why would you put a jug in? Put a Shopkins in. <laughs> There we go, put our raspberry in, you can turn them around. Hmm. Very cool. Awesome. And again, um, that stand has like a cardboard Which piece you can pull out if you wanted to. Right, so how about we stick that... We'll put that up the back. Yes. Move these off here, because we can still see those on camera. We have like a little glass with a mixing spoon, so you can put your smoothie in. Put that maybe just... I can rearrange for you, you can keep looking. And look at that delicious mango. That is mango milly. Mm -hmm. That would make a nice smoothie. It look, does look like the Roman tomato a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. Looks <laughs> like some delicious yogurt. That is Yol yogurt. It's an interesting name. Yol. No, Yol. Yol. Um, There's a balloon. Mary Cranberry. Not a balloon. You don't put a balloon in your smoothies. And if you do, I'm not eating it. It gives me the lift I need to get through the day. <laughs> that is Linda Lime. I like that one. Yeah. Nice green colour. Nice and delicious and limey. Who else do we have? That is Pia Pineapple. Oh, she's got a like slice almost. Like, has, mm. has been taken out of the back of her there. Poor pineapple. Mm. Mm, I like pineapple. That is So Great Chocolate. Mm, and look, it's got a, a grater, I He's got his own grater to grate himself. That's a bit morbid, <laughs> but okay. Poor chocolate. That is... I'm guessing that's Porsche Passion Fruit. It's a lot darker on the checklist. Yeah. It's purple on the checklist, but... And finally... Finally... Is, yes. Annie Orange. I like that. I do too. I Just like the nice, design. Yeah. A nice wedge of orange rather than like a whole orange. Because the orange would have looked a bit too much like... Um, well, we can't... Shove that back a bit. There we go. Looked a bit too much like the cranberry, I, I think, if they've done a whole orange. Zoom in a bit. Now you've cut off the edges. Yeah, we can't see our pineapple friend. There we go. All right, so that was the uh, juice set. Mm. So that's pretty nice. I like the um, the chocolate, although it's a bit odd. It's got its own grater. Should we do the fire pack and leave the cold pack for last? Let's. All right, did a little bit of rearranging. We've opened up our fire pack. And we're ready to look. So I'll get uh, one of the ones off the front of the pack out of the way. It's a duplicate for us. And if you're looking for the name, Nathan, it was in the carrot cake. It's the Cassie Caster Sugar, who is a rare. No, it's not. That's the Ooh. icing sugar. Iris icing sugar. Sorry, <laughs> I looked at that and I'm like, yeah, that, that's it. Yeah, there's a couple of different <laughs> sugar, different types of sugar ones. Um, then we have this one, which looks like it might be a bag of like flour. Well, it says sugar. Oh, it's inside. a sugar. Okay, so maybe that, that's. No, that's not Cassie. That looks like just regular sugar. So it can't be Cassie. Oh, cane sugar. Cane sugar. Oh okay. my god. Okay. Oh my goodness, that is such a hilarious and name. And then we had this one uh, before as well, so this is a duplicate. Um, and I can't remember what it was at all. I, I can't it was like ever. some sort of chocolate ice cream though. I'm pretty sure it was in like the sundae or the ice cream cake or something like that. That's right, you keep going I'll, it's yeah, you keep going and I'll and chalky look, tubs. Yeah. And we look like we've got a jar of uh, either or, maybe tomato sauce or yes, something. Yes, Timmy tomato paste. Tomato paste. Okay, I like that one. It's nice. It's got like the little yellow lid and the little pictures of the tomatoes on it. And that was a common? Common. Okay. And our mystery one in our five pack. We have Sammy Scrambles checklist. There's all the ingredients for Sammy Scrambles. And... What's our mystery like one? A, ooh, a fairly small one in here. Wow, this bag's really hard. Um, it's a different plastic. Mm, yeah. 
That's bizarre. The five packs have different plastic. Ooh. That looks, that looks like, like a, a slice nice of pizza. slice of pizza. A big fat slice of crust. That's crust. Veronica Veggie Pizza, who is the ultra rare. Awesome. So we've done all right with those out of our packs. Yeah. Getting a few of the end results. Let's move those aside. Bring those to the front. All right. Let's open our last pack, our 12 pack. Ooh, sounds good. So right. we have our final 12 pack. Last pack for now. We have a duplicate mm -hmm. of Le Mushroom. Um, oh, well, I can't remember any of the names yet, given this is the first time we've opened any of these. So, let me just I know. Turn a button mushroom it was. And I suspect there'll be a lot of that one, given it's a staple ingredient. We have a lemon. Um, lemon now. What would lemon be in? I think the tea. That is Pippa Lemon. So that's a common. We have another parsley. Okay, I don't remember the pars uh, poly parsley, and she's actually a rare, so hmm. that's kind of nice. Good one to get a double of. Uh, um, looks Ooh. like sprinkles. Sprinkles, maybe um, a bottle of sprinkles. Ooh, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. This checklist is just going to drive me crazy trying to find these. I'm up next. Miss Sprinkles, who is a common and a staple ingredient, apparently. Hmm. So this looks like either a slice of bread or butter. I think that was butter. I saw that one before. Betsy butter. And that's a staple um, common ingredient as well. And we already have this one. Yep. Doesn't mean I remember what it is. Is that the ice cream? I think it is. It's, yes, vanilla tubs. Vanilla ice cream in a tub. Looks like we have another Roma tomato. Yeah. Which will be our third Roma tomato. And by of the, the day. way, Roma tomato is not a staple ingredient, so it's actually only used in one recipe. Yeah, now, that one looks like basil. That is, I would say, yes, basil, which is Bridie Basil, and that is our special edition colour changer for the 12 pack. Mm. So yeah. we'll, we'll, we'll test those out um, at the end of the video. I think it uses cold, cold water, but yeah. Looks like we have a pumpkin. A what? You mean <laughs> a carrot, I hope. Karen Carrot, who's also a staple and a common. And our final one looks like another tea bag. It's a tea L, a herb L bag or something, or tea L bag. Um, can't find the tea recipe. What am I doing? Lemon and honey tea recipe. It's herb L tea bag, so it's a common. Yeah, who do we have here? We have. Freddy fried rice. Beautiful. So we got five uh, different little. We've um, still got another bag to open too. Checklists. Oh yeah, well that's right. We've so got. We could have another one. Of course, we have two from the twelve pack, don't we? Uh, what am I thinking? <laughs> oh. Oh, that looks nice. That. It's one of the dazzling as the camera's picking up the shininess. Yeah, I'm just not quite sure. It's who. the sweets honey. Yes, yeah, so it's the honeycomb ice cream cake, sweets honey. Which is an ultra rare. So the ultra rare are meant to be um, a glitter. Fin uh, they're sort of metallic, but they're not. A dazzling sort of finish or something, so. And look, look who we got. Oh, Veronica Veggie Pizza. So look we got. Who is right there? Woohoo! So we got six different of the little recipe cards, so that's really good. Six out of 18 so far. Oh. Yeah, different bags. Yeah. They're a darker colour, the five packs. Looks like we can have another mozzarella. Uh, yeah. I don't know where you found the mozzarella. Oh, yeah, Bella Mozzarella, who was a rare mm. as well. So that's kind of nice. Well, yeah, um, I really like those. So did I. Um, we're just going to go and test out these colour changes for you. And we'll be right back. All right. Funny story here. <laughs> They're not actually activated by cold water. No. So it's not cold. It's warmth. Yeah, so... <laughs> so we don't need our ice water. So you get the topping and you sort of... You basically just warm it up with your hand. I mean, you could do it with something else warm, but... You see it's sort of gone a white colour. And same with our basil. Uh, the bottom is green, but then if you sort of give it a bit of a... A rub. A rub with a warm hand, it turns white. It doesn't stay that way for very long, though. Still, it's very cool. It's just nice to have something different, I think. And it's only the bag. On the basil. And this um, one's the only top. the top for the, the yogurt. Frosting. Frosting. Yes. So, yeah, just something a little bit different. I think it's nice to have kind of... A lot better than at least Season 5 Charms. Oh, yeah, definitely. I, hands down, like Season 6 way better <laughs> than Season 5 or even the Happy Places as well or... Yeah. Yeah. 
Um, I like cooking though, so I guess it appeals to me. But I thought these were awesome. So do I. <laughs> Very much so. Um, if anyone knows why they're calling it a limited um, season, let us know down below. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button either. And give us a thumbs up if you enjoy watching us open this mega huge sort of range of Shopkins Season 6 Chef Club. And thank you for sticking around. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.